Welcome to the channel, I trust that you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to show you how to deposit coins into Binance from another wallet address. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to leave me a like and hit subscribe. I have plenty more Binance tutorials on my YouTube channel, so feel free to check those out as well. Let's get into the video. To deposit coins into Binance, come up to the top right hand side of the screen, hover over wallet, and select fiat and spot from this drop down menu. And here inside the Fiat and Spot Wallet Overview is where you can deposit cryptocurrency into the Binance platform from another exchange, from a cold wallet, a hot wallet, wherever you might be depositing the coins from. You'll notice over here on the right that each one of these coins has its own deposit button. If you don't see the coin that you wish to deposit straight away, you can search for it right here in the search bar. Once you find the coin that you're looking for, you just come over here on the right and you'd click on that coin's deposit button. I'll go ahead and demonstrate with Ethereum. That will bring you over to this page here. You can also change the coin that you wish to deposit by clicking right here, selecting it from this drop down menu, or searching for the coin in this search bar. Next, you'll need to choose a network that you wish to send the coins over, and you can do that by simply clicking on the network box. Then Binance will be showing you a pop-up window of the available networks that you can use to deposit that specific coin. You can choose a network by simply clicking on it. Some networks charge less in fees to use when depositing your coins, but it's very important to make sure that the network matches on both sides of this transaction or your coins could be lost. For simplicity, I'll deposit some coins from another exchange into Binance in this demonstration. So I'll go ahead and quickly drag another exchange in the frame like so. I'm going to come up to assets, withdraw. And then I'll go ahead and I'll select Ethereum. Here I can see under networks that this exchange supports three networks, ERC20, BSC, and Arbitrum1. So I'll go ahead and select the Arbitrum1 network. And I'll quickly drag this out of frame. Then I'll come to network here on Binance. And as you can see, Binance supports the Arbitrum 1 network. So we'll go ahead and give that a click. Now Binance is generating a deposit address over the Arbitrum 1 network for our Ethereum. We can copy this address by simply clicking right here. If you were sending from a smartphone, you can actually hover over this icon, you'll get a QR code, and you could scan that code. To keep things simple, I'm just going to copy this address right here. Now quickly drag the other exchange back into frame like so. And in this box here, I'm going to paste my Binance deposit address for Ethereum using the Arbitrum 1 network. Now I need to choose the amount of coins that I wish to withdraw and deposit into Binance. I can see my available balance right here, so I can put a custom amount in if I choose, something like so. Or I could just simply click on this max button here to withdraw the entire amount from this exchange and deposit it into Binance. Typically what I'll do is I'll deposit a small amount first, just to make sure that I have everything set up correctly. If the transaction goes through, then I'll make a larger deposit. Now that I have this set up the way that I want it, I'll just simply click on withdraw. I'm gonna put in my two-factor authentication, and then the coins will be on the way from this exchange into the Binance exchange. I have now completed my withdrawal, and the coins are on the way to Binance. Once your deposit arrives to Binance, you'll get a notification. You can see it up here in this little bell. You can see that my deposit was already successful. To find the coins, we'll come up here to Wallet, click on Fiat and Spot. And here's where we can find the Ethereum that I deposited. And there you have it. That's how you deposit coins from another wallet address. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and hit subscribe. Also, feel free to check out my other Binance tutorials that I put together for you in a playlist on my YouTube channel. Thanks so much for coming by and checking out this video. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. And until I do, have yourself a powerful day.